This is a bushingfix.com video for the CA1 kit, which comes in two variations. A lot of cars will have two round cables. Some cars will have one round and one oblong cable, so make sure you've got the correct kit for your vehicle. If you've got the oblong cable on one of your cables, this one presses in pretty easy once you've got the old bushing out. You just put it in not quite straight, at a slight angle, and you can use your finger to depress the tangs. And it helps if you put it on a hard surface or something that'll hold it still. And once you've got them slightly depressed and it starts to push in, you can push it in evenly, push it all the way through until those tangs engage on the other side. For the round cable end, you'll have a retaining cup, a bushing, and a protective cap. And the retainer clips onto the cable end. And you can set the bushing into place like this and put the cap on. Now, if you've got strong fingers, you can slightly depress the tangs while pushing down, and you can push everything into place. It takes a little bit of strength. But if you want to use some channel locks, it's also equally as easy to do it with those. And once you press the bushing into place, clip it onto the transmission lever and shift it around and be sure everything's in place. And that's it, you're done. Thanks for watching.